back here at home, there are approximately 400,000 children in the nation's foster care system. Many of them face enormous challenges once they age out. Well, in tonight's Eye on America, CBS's Mark Strassman takes a look at how one program is fostering hope by giving young people the skills they need to succeed. At 17, senior Julie Penafort could be just another kid bouncing around California's foster care system. Instead, she's found hope with help. They're like family to me, so it's like I look up to them a lot, and they've made a big impact in my life. They are First Star Academy at UCLA. This privately funded national program on 15 college campuses recruits, practically rescues, foster care kids when they're high school freshmen. It teaches them life skills and, you could say, improbably pulls college dreams out of a black trash bag. So a lot of foster youth know what the black um, trash bag means. Sometimes they only get a couple minutes to pack everything that they have in this room and take it to the next placement. When a caseworker shows up with a black trash bag, they know it means it's time to go again. Yes. Sometimes they don't get an alert. Nationally, roughly half of foster kids graduate high school. 10% go to college. But First Star seniors, 97% graduate high school. Roughly two out of three enroll in four-year colleges. What is it your program is doing right? We are providing them positive adult role model that is going to be with them for four years. Consistency. is the key word. I just think childhood experiences, you're taught to, you know, keep your head down, be quiet, to stay out of trouble and not get yelled at. Isael Andrade is Julie's mentor. Now 23, this former foster kid went to seven different middle schools. I went to the same stuff that Julie did. You know, our stories are very similar. Once a month for four years, they've met in person. But they're constantly talking, making sure she's on track. It's like, I see him as a brother. What's the biggest thing he's taught you? I think I had to stand up for myself. <laughs> would you at 13 recognize you at 17? No, I would not. Julie's applying to college now. Whatever she does, I'm going to be proud of her. Her first choice, UCLA. For Eye on America, Mark Strassman in Los Angeles.